Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are, I send my greetings to you. This is your brother, your son, and your friend, servant Aaron Heavens, the servant of the Most High, the ancient breed. Today, I want to share with you this tree. I don't know how uh, it is being called, but it's one of the boundary trees. Uh -huh. It's one of the boundary trees. I don't know the English name for it, but in my local language, we call it entome. You can normally find this plant or this tree around cemeteries, around farms, like cocoa farms and the rest. Or people used to share or to indicate their land from the other people's land or their property from other people's property. But mainly, this is used for demarcation. It is used for boundary, especially uh, around cemeteries. It indicates the cemetery from the residential areas. Spiritually, this is used at the cemetery to show the dead, the boundary from the residential or the plant this tree at the cemetery so that the dead will know this is their boundary so they don't cross to the living's land or to the living's mist. Spiritually, it is used to demarcate lands and again it is used for a lot of spiritual things but i'm not going to share most of it i'm not going to share the negative side of it because people would misuse it so i'm only going to share the good side of it i am only going to share the good side of it but you can use this thing to separate yourself spiritually from any bondage any evil or spiritual or any demonic bondage that you are in you can use this thing to bath you can put this thing in your water bathing water to bath to separate you spiritually from any form of demonic bondage to separate you from any form of demonic bondage if you were in a family where there is evil or there's any form of bondage, any form of setbacks, any form of retrogression that you want to separate yourself from it, you can use this to separate yourself from it spiritually. You can use it to separate yourself spiritually. All you need to do is to get about seven of them, then soak it in your bathing water, then you bath it for seven days. Pray over it, and you will be bathing it for seven consecutive days. Do it in the morning or in the evening to separate you any form of spiritual bondage you can also prepare it as soap you can also prepare it as soap and use it to bath for seven consecutive days it will separate you from any bondage you can also use it to separate people you can use it to separate people if you have a daughter or a son who is having a relationship with someone and you don't like it can use this thing to separate them or you can use this thing to separate people you can use this thing to separate family but this for this one people misuse it so i will not take this one and again you can use this thing to render idols powerless or you can use this thing to render idols impotent but for this kind of uh, rendering idols impotent it need a priest or a prophet or any form of a spiritualist to to do it yes. After that, there will be a lot of attacks. So you can use this thing to render idols impotent or powerless. And again, you can use this thing for a lot, a lot of things. But most especially, uh, I'm teaching this for you to be able to separate yourself spiritually from any form of bondage. So you can use this thing to bath. You can use it to prepare soup and use it to bath for seven consecutive days. As I said, it is used to separate things spiritually. So if you have some at your area or your cemetery, you can go for it and put it in your bathroom water you pray over it and use it for seven consecutive days if you need the soap too you can use it to prepare the soap if you want us to do it for you you can contact us and we we'll do it for you too my contact is plus 233 243 471776 i am in accra hamasamai so if you need any form of spiritual help or we have any form of sickness or any ailment that you think is spiritual you've tried so many remedies and it's not going you can contact us and by the grace of god we get rid of it for you if you have any physical sickness too that you need remedy for it you can come to us and we will prepare and give you forms of choice of medicine to get rid of it if you want to join our group there's a token you will need to pay and we add you to our various platforms we teach anything spiritual and physical we teach anything spiritual that you will need to protect yourself and to elevate you from one place to the other so if you have any form of or if you need any form of help spiritually and physically i say physically i mean in form of ailments 
or any form of sickness you can contact us and we give you a helping hand as i said we are in accra ghana amasamai to be precise so you can contact us if you want to join the group it will be a very beneficial thing for you because you will be able to learn a couple of things spiritually how to solve your own things or how to solve your own problems spiritually and physically in terms of sickness you'll be able to help yourself without going to anybody please share this video follow our page and like our page and kindly subscribe to our youtube channel i will leave the link in the comment section bonsoir chers frères et sœurs c'est la voix de votre enfant frère et serviteur Aaron Heaven of Truth Seekers ce soir je viens vous parler de cette plante qui peut vous servir ou vous aider à se débarrasser des problèmes spirituels ceci pour vous dire que si quelqu'un se fait manipuler par des démons soit maudit ou tu es dans une famille maudite qui ne progresse pas à cause d'une quelconque manipulation maléfique alors vous irez en où vous allez trouver cette plante que je vous montre dans la vidéo et qu'allez-vous faire avec la dite plante et cette plante a pour le nom Ntome dans la langue communément parlée au Ghana la langue Tui et Anévé, Anya vous savez en Afrique nous parlons beaucoup de dialectes et le nom de chaque chose, plante ou arbre fruitier ont leur nom dans chaque langue que nous parlons sur le continent. Alors, vous aurez le nom de cette plante dans votre langue locale. Alors, vous irez chercher cette plante qu'on utilise souvent pour faire des démarcations dans les champs, au village et aussi aux abords des cimetières pour empêcher l'esprit des morts à ne pas aller au-delà de ses limites. Et quand vous trouverez cette plante, vous arracherez sept de ces feuilles, bien les laver et après leur lavage, vous les mettez dans votre seau d'eau à laver en ajoutant de l'eau. Et vous vous lavez avec cette eau-là pendant sept jours consécutifs. Et tout le problème que vous avez, c'est fini. Cette plante peut être également utilisée pour beaucoup de choses spirituelles. Elle est aussi bonne pour les pères et mères de famille, pour protéger votre fille ou fils contre des relations que vous, les parents, vous n'approuvez pas. Et si vous avez un problème ou une maladie corporelle, physique ou spirituelle, vous pouvez me contacter sur mon numéro. Je suis au Ghana, à Accra, plus précisément au quartier Amasaman. Et mon numéro de téléphone, c'est plus 233. 243 47 17 76 Votre humble serviteur Aaron Heaven Merci beaucoup Ebu shen fo sene me kan yeno aban we ye fene ntome me yede se mo bebre enim tome most at times no be hu e wo cemetery ene nko fo e fu mu e de e de e to si e de to si e de to si e from land land nko fo asase so amudi si si amu asase ano amudi be hu so amu asase ni mostly e ya na amudi si cemetery ha to indicate baby and comfort here any baby a cemetery war the spiritually you fool no and that's some man for no one who say or more or more territory ni or more territory ni until you don't have to cross over i think so and to me ya but to me at the abo or who by an answer would ye or who if you a hobby am or how are you spiritual a be a wood de bush maybe more and you man kwee ye wibush and more will be a four percent we will have him with me then to me a jarret would be in to me a jarret and my we will have a fish a honey with the internal be dry seven days Seven consecutive days. And so, but see, and Tom and I go back to seven. No, dear Guns, you bet me so the soup as a seminar. No, dear Gary, seven consecutive days. So, who pay be a bit me? I be a man. I contact you a bit me. I be a man. Number is 0243471776. Accra, I'm a summary. And they are what? Sir, and Tom and I cry a bit me is a dear to see at the four and Tim. Bet me the other tea at the four and Tim. Bet me the other tea at the four and Tim. But in a year, uncle for a pep bonny D. I said bonny D. Pa and see no. Mentre ha mo ye hinye pa bet me that it's so hm if he or say him I say be any form of uh home. I feel so se bosom that's a summa be will fee no person with two summa na the sad ye we it me it to sa summa and if you ho and tome me to summa I mompe it will be soon what me to 
if you hope it. So I'm kind of no open manaya. I just say when you're soft will be and I saw be as soon as you may our nims I will now I yeah I'm out and two PB and I saw a hobby uh yeah spiritually and I saw a hobby as soon as you how and I wa ya dear be why yeah uncle say as soon as you dear say yeah when name ya dear but more than February be dying and why I saw yeah be funny medium so I wow and my own at all the way you and why yeah sir we be asking me the base here median servants area on heavens the servants of the most high the ancient breed the video